we've been on the battleground the first day the Kenosha protest jumped off. We we brought the whole we brought half of the city of Milwaukee uh to Kenosha and we kicked that off because Kenosha has never stood up for nothing by themselves. So we went out there and the night the same night, you know, the militia was out there. They started throwing bleach on us from roofs and stuff like that, spraying bleach on us. Then they had came out and bought and, and the people inside of the protest, they start shooting flares from, from amongst us so the people can return fire at us. And then that happened. So they start shooting bombs at us and stuff like that. So it got a little bit crazy every single day we went out there, it was a little worse. So we put so we employed our defense unit as a uh, part of our organization. Then we got dispatched to uh to Madison by the mayor of Madison because the militia was up there, assumably, and we took about 30 of our people to Madison and the rest of our people went to Kenosha. So while we were up there in Madison, we got a call while we was up there interrupting what was going on. We got a call that our people had been shot on the ground and uh, one of our medics were shot while trying to aid and assist someone that was uh, that was injured or whatnot. They blew his arm off. And uh, then they proceeded to start <clears throat> snatching our people up. They snatched up two of our people and stuffed them in vans, kidnapped them. We didn't know if it was the police. We didn't know who it was because we on the ground with people that look like allies, but they're enemies amongst us. And so those two people were snatched up. We want to hunt for those people. Then they slashed about 20 of our tires so we can be trapped in a battle zone and have no way out. Um, so we had to leave Madison and we rushed back. <sighs> We rushed back to try to support the people who were on the ground, who had lost, who had lost the ability to travel. And uh, so those people we were worried about, the other brother, Gage, who was shot, uh, whose arm was almost nearly blown off. He was in a hospital and they also killed two people. We've been raising money to reimburse people for their expenses. Uh, that they had occurred as a result of this uh, this last massacre that they tried to put down on us. And we also been organizing resources to uh, advance our cause. Our people back on the ground, they, 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 uh, they, they marching through Tulsa right now, but uh, we got them restricted um, from Kenosha to further notice.